Hello, my name is Keith Walden. I want to talk to you today about uh, mental health, uh, mental health around not being able to exercise and what can we do about that. Um, as well as going through this pandemic, which obviously in, on its own brings some mental issues, there are lots of other reasons why uh, we can't exercise. We can't go out, obviously. The gyms are closed. And for some people, maybe they're at home with children or for other reasons can't go out. So I've devised a series of exercises for you, the 10 exercises at three different levels that you can do in your home with no space. You only need a chair at most, but you can do these exercises. Now, exercise can help bring about uh, a lack of depression. So exercise produces serotonin, endorphins and other feel good chemicals, which then offset depression. So the following exercises, there are 10 of them, three different levels. You can pick and choose whichever level you prefer. And just make sure that you don't overdo it, um, both in terms of on the day. So you should feel it, you should finish it feeling that you've done a little bit of work, but it's not too strenuous because if it's too strenuous, you won't want to repeat it. When you've done, let's say five of these in a week and don't do any more than about five times a week, and, you've, um, and you're probably up to about six, seven, eight, nine, ten exercise levels. If you wish, you can then go to the next level of the same exercise. But that's up to you. A little bit frequently is going to be much better than if you don't do any exercise whatsoever. If you're a sports therapist um, listening to this, then you might want to send the exercise regimes themselves out to your patients and your clients so that they have something to do which is easily reprodu reproducible in their own home. I hope you enjoy it. Thank you.